Hello, my loves. Welcome back to my channel. As you guys can tell, this is going to be a love reading for my lovely Cancers. This can be for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Lil, you name it. Or you can just be curious. There's nothing wrong with that. Um, let's go ahead and get started. My loves, open minds, open hearts. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get a card for you for your overall theme for the reading, all right? I hear I hear the phrase you're moving okay so that could be physically that could be you just moving on from a situation or a particular person okay um let's go ahead and get a card out for you just one please I just saw indecision you could be in contemplation like a two of swords energy um right now um do I stay do I go whatever that is in your life okay um Courage. I find the inner strength to face uh, fear with confidence. I think Sagittarius got this. So you could have that in your chart to be dealing with the Sagittarius or it could just be the energy. Okay. Um, you need to find the courage and the inner strength to, to move forward. Okay. So with confidence, when we have higher confidence, we know our worth. We know what, what we deserve. We know our boundaries, our morals and values, what, what we're willing to allow in and what we need to release, okay? And we don't stay in that indecisive energy too long, okay? I think it's good to think through whatever you're going through, your decisions, but um, higher confidence allows us to make those firm decisions and be comfortable with it and not live in regret or remorse or um, feel sadness or pity I'm hearing, okay? For whoever it is, um, whether it's yourself or other people or situations, I don't know. You'll know how that resonates for you and how that speaks to you, okay? Failure, I understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn exactly. So don't, I'm sorry, I think I have to too high up, but don't be too hard on yourself. Don't even be too hard on others, okay? <laughs> right now, it's, it's just not valuable. I feel intuitively, but follow your intuition, okay? And what feels right to you, all right? Um, but don't accept your mistakes as your lessons, okay? It's just an opportunity for you to learn, okay? Um, so, sometimes it's neither good nor bad. It's just is, all right? Um, I also do pick up like a karma thing as well, too. So that could be tied to karma. So sometimes when I think of karma, I believe it's things that are like out of your control, okay? So it's something that you just have to weather the storm through, um, it could be a valuable lesson. It, it could not. Okay. I know. I know. But um, that could make you very emotional as well, too, at this point in time around. Um, but you deserve more cancer, I'm hearing. Okay. You just deserve more in life. Okay. And if you feel that you deserve that, then you will have it. But it starts with the You have to feel that you deserve that first. Um, time you are trying too hard, give it time. Okay. Let me get, I think, two more cards on that message. We have um, soulmate. Your soulmate is already with you in spirit. Believe this and they will manifest physically. So give it time in regards to your soulmate. Not confidence, not courage or becoming braver um, or decision making. I think that's a strong focus for you. And I feel like that you're focusing on this probably a little bit too much. And I, I know, I know I have a ton of cancer in my chart. I get it. Um... But this will come in divine timing. And I know it's so hard for us to hear that as humans. Um, but it's not the time for, okay, we, the, 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 the increasing, the confidence, the self-esteem, I'm also hearing self-awareness is going to draw this person in, all right? And the person that you're truly looking for, you couldn't feel like that you have been connecting with a lot of people that are lower frequency, quote unquote, all right? Um, you want to move away from that energy, but you can't really figure out why, okay? And it's making you, like, really emotional, and you don't understand why. If you're if you're pouring into people and, um, and, you, and you're giving all of yourself, which is pouring into people and giving all of yourself, okay? If that's what you're doing, Cancer, you have to keep some for yourself, okay? Balance. You don't empty your cup out 
empty your cup out to fill another empty cup. Okay, their cup is empty. You have to allow them to fill their cup on their own time. And you just give just a little bit every now and then as a queen of cups, okay? That is you at your highest is the queen of cups, all right? So pour a little bit out and allow people to show you that they are deserving of you sharing your little bit from your cup, all right? As time goes on and you evaluate, key emphasis on time, right? You have to allow time to grow and allow people, um, I'm sorry, allow, uh, give things time to allow things to grow, okay? In any aspect of your life, all right? Whether that's career, relationships, mentally, spiritually, circumstances, whatever you name it. Give things time to grow, to develop. Also, get a... Um, to get a sense of things, okay, of how much you should give out, what's your decision, what's your stand on, all right? That's very key right now for you. At the bottom of the deck, we have close your eyes and tell yourself that you deserve to feel joyful. Come on, somebody. You can allow joy into your life regardless of circumstances you are currently finding yourself in. I think Sagittarius had this card as well, too, okay? So if you feel drawn to watch that reading, I would definitely encourage you to do so, okay? I'm going to leave it right there, my loves, okay? So if you resonated with this reading um, or if you simply enjoyed it, please let me know in the comment section below. I'd love to hear from you guys. Um, also, don't forget uh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Most importantly, my loves, if you have not heard this, um, you are loved and you are cherished, okay? Take your time, Cancer, okay? There's no rush. I feel a very rushed energy to get through something, to get over something. And you may be uh, tempted to take a shortcut um, or you may be tempted to take an opportunity that's really not in your benefit because you want something quick and fast and it could be more detrimental to you in the end. Of course, we, like we said earlier, our mistakes are our lessons. So if we get to that point again, it'll just redirect us onto the path we're supposed to be on. Okay. So, um, I'm going to leave it there now. Um, if I didn't already say this, um, you are loved and you are cherished. Okay. So don't forget that. Um, until next time, my loves, okay? Bye-bye.